Welcome learners to the Library and Information Science program for senior secondary level. Uh, I am Dr. Akash Singh. In uh, previous program, we learned about the modern library services. In this program, we will learn about library system and management. Basically, first of all, we should know about what is system. Let us understand library as a system. Uh, you must have seen various existing systems like political system, economic system, social system, education system, etc. We, the human being, are a biological system which has many subsystems like digestive system, blood system, circulatory system, repository systems, etc. So, uh, the library is also a system. The primary objective of any library system is to collect, store, organize, retrieve and make available the information sources to the information users. A library as a system is a subsystem of uh, some super system like an organization in any field, whether education, research or social services. It has its own subsystems uh, such as uh, acquisition system, circulation system, administration system, etc. So, uh, the objective of uh, this lessons are uh, basically define about the library system, identify functions of library management, list various structural component of a library system and explaining about functioning of various sections of a library like acquisition section, technical section, processing section, circulation section, reference section, periodical uh, maintenance section and administration and financial section. Basically, uh, first of all, uh, library uh, is, uh, a is an organization uh, which also follow the rule of management. So, the library management uh, functions uh, uh, like any other organization, it do planning, controlling, leading, staffing and organizing. So, uh, library management is the adoption of the principles and techniques of management to the library uh, situation. It includes decision making and getting the work done by others. The five fundamental management functions are planning, organizing, staffing, leading and controlling and the library management means efficient and effective management of material uh, means information source, machinery, men uh, means human resources technology and money to meet the objective of the library. Thus, librarian as a manager performs all the functions of the manager or administrator. Henry Fuel explains uh, uh, principles of management like planning, organizing, staffing, uh, leading also known as coordinating, controlling. Now, we will uh, discuss uh, in brief about all these functions. The first uh, principle of management is planning. Uh, planning includes formalization of goal, objectives, decision making uh, for future uh, strategies, policies and effective planning. The second uh, principle is organizing. Organizing includes departmental line and staff functions, decentralization, committees and uh, group decisions and effective organizing. The third uh, principle of management is the staffing, you know, uh, as you know, uh, it uh, includes selection, job description, appointment, uh, appointing uh, personals, appraisal, developing library managers and organization, uh, organizational development. The fourth uh, principle uh, of management as explained by the Henry Fiol is uh, leading, it uh, basically deals with human factors, motivation, uh, leadership and communication. The last uh, or the fifth uh, principle of Henry Fuel for the management is uh, the controlling. It includes system and process of controlling, control techniques, control of overall performance and effective uh, managing. Then uh, the elements of management. In 1937, social scientist Luther uh, Gulick and L. Orwick describe seven major activities and duties of any chief executives. Since then, uh, the acronym POST-CORB is used uh, to describe the seven functions of managers referred to as the element of management. The acronym uh, POST-CORB stands for planning, organizing, staffing, direction, coordinating, reporting and budgeting. So, uh, these are the element uh, basically uh, start from planning uh, to organizing, staffing, 
directing, controlling, budgeting and reporting. These are the elements of the management. So, uh, library system has three major component as a, uh, as a management. Uh, we should know about uh, how many components are there for a library. The first uh, component is the reader and the second component is its book and third is its staff for which we have to manage. As a librarian, we have to manage all the things. Here the books are the knowledge containers, readers uh, are the knowledge seekers and staff uh, means the facilitators or providers of various library services to the users or the knowledge seekers. Whenever and whatever this trinity exists, a library is born. A library exists at a moment when three components of its trinity like the readers, the books and the staff are in uh, purposive contact with one another. Library has uh, different sections like acquisition section, technical processing section, circulation section, reference section, periodical section, maintenance section and administrative and finance section. So, uh, we will discuss about all the section one by one. Uh, first, we will discuss about the acquisition section. Every library has to build up a collection of information sources, uh, means knowledge containers. These are maybe in part or uh, in print or non-print uh, or electronic format. Functions of acquisition section include selection, ordering, receiving, supplying, making or supplying, uh, making order uh, entries in the stock register and processing the bills for the payment. Acquisition of library material has three main check control like uh, availability of library fund, use of reading material and need of library users. The second section uh, is the technical processing section. Uh, the newly acquired books are prepared for library use. For this purpose, uh, these are classified, catalogued entries uh, filed in library catalog and books shelved on display racks or in the stake. As a visitor to the library, you may not be familiar of such function in a library because these functions are performed behind the scene. The next section is the circulation section. This section deal with membership work, issue and return of book, uh, bespoken work and uh, such related job. Uh, generally, a uh, specially designed circulation counter is used for doing circulation work. You are uh, very much familiar with the section uh, because uh, you uh, receive the maximum of dealing from library to uh, meet larger part of your library needs at circulation counter. The next section is the reference section. This is also a very important section. Reference section collect and organize a number of uh, reference books. Reference book is one which is not read a like te textbook for uh, beginning to end. You refer to a reference book uh, to know the answer of your specific query. This uh, which may pertain to a word, term, person, place, concept or subject. You need to consult a dictionary, thesaurus, directory, yearbook, encyclopedia or uh, such other type of reference book. The reference librarian is expected to provide right information to the right person at the right time. So, the next uh, section we are going to discuss is the periodical section. Periodical section collect and organize a number of periodical published such as journal, magazine, newspaper. A periodical uh, published like serial publication is published in continuity and with predefined periodicity such as daily, weekly, fortnightly, monthly etc. A library first receive the current issue of the volume of a peri periodical publication later on the completed volume uh, may be got bound and shelved in the periodical section. The current issue uh, are displayed in specially designed periodical racks. The next section is the maintenance section. Maintenance work is the backbone of any object, structure, organization, institution and so much so uh, in a library also. You already know that after buying cloth or books or uh, stationery or computer, you have to take a special care of your uh, possessions uh, for their proper and prolonged use. In a library, maintenance section does regularly such a job as collection building, shelving and uh, reshelving dusting and cleaning, mending and building, weeding and stock verification. So, uh, in uh, just uh, saying word maintenance uh, section is uh, just uh, look uh, a small uh, entity, but a maintenance section does a regular job as organizing of collection, shelving and reshelving, dusting and cleaning, 
bending and binding uh, weeding stock verification. Now we will discuss uh, about this maintenance section in a little bit brief. Basically in maintenance section uh, collection is organized a library take into consideration the nature of material and its use and accordingly uh, it organize its collection, reference collection, non-print material including electronic material etc. Books in all uh, such section beside uh, the main collection are allotted a symbol for the type of collection which is put at the top of the call number of the item. So, uh, the second uh, work in uh, the maintenance section is shelving and reshelving. All the items as reading material are arranged on shelf in a helpful order. The item used by users are to be restored in the proper position on the shelf. The next function of the manage, uh, maintenance section is dusting and cleaning. Dust and dirt which accumulates on the item on shelves are to be removed regularly at periodical gap. Dust free and well maintained library material not only attracts the users but also enhance its use. The next function of management section is mending and binding. At time uh, the item in the collection suffer minor or major damage. These are uh, to be got repaired, uh, mending is done for minor uh, damage and uh, binding is done for major damages to the document. With the help of minding and binding, the damaged items get uh, renewed life. And another uh, function of the maintenance section is weeding. Weeding is required for all such items which can uh, no longer be put to use uh, due to damage. Uh, beyond a repair or have uh, become outdated. The another and the most important function of the maintenance section is stock verification. When the library collection is put uh, to maximum use, particularly in open access, some items are lost. These lost uh, items uh, create a great amount of uh, problems for the users and the staff. An item lost shows uh, the presence in the library catalog and other uh, record but it is not found on shelf. To identify for the lost item stock verification of library materials required. Stock verification help in finding out what is as against what it was in the library collection. After uh, such findings the library records are uh, to be updated in a view of the records of lost items. Uh, this help smooth flow of library use and library services. Next and the last section of the library is the administration and finance section. The purpose of the administration section is to promote those activities which relate to library administration and management issues in general. The section is intended to serve the needs of library staff especially who's, who supervise other staff. It helps management operations of other sections of the library. The administration and financial section maintains the records, record of the official file, diary and dispatch, library budget proposal, budgetary allocation, accounts of the library expenditure, stock registers. So sections of the library functions uh, in a various uh, uh, ways, sections like reference section, circulation section, technical section, acquisition sections and administration and financial sections. So the, finish, uh, the functions of the administration and, fi uh, administration and uh, financial section is record and file keeping, diary and dispatch, allocation and expenditure, stock registers, caretaking of library property. Then the function of acquisition section is uh, selection of book, ordering, receiving, uh, supply, accessing and processing bill. And the function of the technical processing is classification, cataloging, card filing and shelving. And the function uh, of the circulation section is membership work, issuing uh, means charging uh, and returning means discharging. Function of uh, reference sections uh, are collection formation and the answering of the queries. So uh, the function of the periodical section uh, is to recording receipt display uh, uh, and uh, the preparation of volume uh, for binding. And the function for the maintenance section is uh, the formation of collection, dusting and cleaning, mending and binding, weeding uh, and stock verification. 
So, uh, dear learners, uh, in this unit uh, we learnt a number of things. Now, uh, we will discuss about that. Uh, we uh, just learnt about definition and example of system which is complex whole with the entity to serve a purpose and has interrelated and interdependent component. Library works as a system in a subsystem of some super system and is having its own subsystem. In library management, all principles and techniques of management are applied library managers performs all the, uh, the five basic function of management. Components of library systems are described. Library is a trinity, uh, uh, universe of knowledge seeker, universe of knowledge uh, container and universe of service provider. It provides perpetual and lifelong education. Sections in a library are acquisition section, technical, processing, circulation, reference, periodical, maintenance and administration and financial section. Each section performs specialized library activities. Thank you learners for patiently listening and understanding about the module uh, library system and management. We will meet in the next module uh, till then uh, goodbye.